Hi, my name is Tom Gagliano, and I'm a life coach with a master's in social work. I'm also a published author. The name of my book is The Problem Was Me with Dr. Abraham Tversky. And by the way, my wife loved that title, The Problem Was Me. So I'm here to talk about the ways we can give our children the inner strength that they need as parents to help them protect themselves from being bullied by other kids. First, a little bit about myself. I was a bully as a kid, but before I was a bully, I was a victim. Well, I can gladly say that I spent many years fixing the damage inside of me, and I'm very grateful to tell you that I've given my children what my father couldn't give me, to be their hero, to guide them when they needed it, to give them a shoulder to cry on, as well as an ear to listen to their feelings and their struggles. So that's the first tip. Provide a safe environment for your children where they could share their feelings, even if it's not what you want to hear. Their fears, their struggles, their sexual orientation, whatever it might be. You know, as a kid, if I should share my feelings with my dad, or God forbid cry, he used to call me his little girl. Very harmful comment and statement that I didn't want to give to my children. So if your child doesn't have a safe person to talk to at home, they're suffering from an inner pain and they may feel that they deserve to be bullied or punished. Believe me, bullies target kids with this wound. Choose your battles with your children. We all want to guide our children. We all want them to read the script that we have written for them. But sometimes you have to relinquish the need to be right and instead choose closeness. Listen to your children's struggles. Sometimes a child will listen to you a lot more when you listen to them. Next, permit mistakes. Give your children the message that they can make a mistake. Doesn't mean they are a mistake. If we deny our children compassion when they stumble in life, we're negating a very vital part of their humanness. They won't have compassion for themselves or compassion for others. This is what a bully is. A bully is someone that has no compassion for themselves or compassion for others. The next tip I would like to share is to be curious with your children. Know who your children's friends are, know what their likes and dislikes are, know what the sites that they go on. Be curious with your children. They may look at you like you have three heads, but you know what? You're giving them the message that they matter, that they count. The next tip is to confer with your inner child. What I mean by this is when you see a child struggle, instead of reacting, stop and pause and think for a minute, what would I have wanted to hear from my parents at that time? Let compassion guide what you say and the way you say it. Finally, monitor your inner critic. If you have an inner critic, that little voice inside your head that doesn't go away, constantly telling you what you're doing wrong, never allowing you to celebrate your victories, you will give that inner critic to your children. So if we're not working on our inner voices, no matter what we do, we're gonna give that to our children. I hope you found these tips helpful. If you have any feedback or questions, please visit me on my website, www.theproblemwasme.com. Thank you.